Hey, I'm Julie, Bait Bam Balzer, and today I want to talk to you about the importance of a daily practice of creativity. Now, I know you're going to say, Julie, 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 I don't have time. And listen, you really don't need a lot of time to make a daily commitment. 10 minutes a day is enough. So let's backtrack for just one second. What are some of the benefits of making art or doing something creative every single day? Well, the first big benefit is your health. For real, there have been studies that prove that making art, doing something creative, really improves your health. Not only your mental health, because it makes you happy, it can relax you, it can remove a lot of stress and worry from your life, but your actual physical health can be improved by making art, even if you're bad at it. <laughs> Maybe even especially if you're bad at it. Just the act of that creativity is deeply healing. And major benefit number two is if you want to get better, you know what they say, practice, practice, practice. And there's nothing like a daily practice to make sure that that improvement happens. Now, I recently heard James Clear, who is a motivational speaker who has written a book called Atomic Habits, speak a little bit about his theory of improvement. And I really liked it. So what he said is if you put an ice cube on a table in a, let's say 20 degree Fahrenheit room, right? And you keep raising the temperature one degree, one degree, one degree, you're not going to see anything happen until it gets to 32 degrees or, you know, above freezing. And yet it's the same degree from 31 to 32 as it was from 22 to 23. So improvement or change is really what I would say can be sudden and unexpected, but really it's just because you pass some kind of threshold. So you may not see that change happen every single day, but overall in the arc, you will see the improvement from daily practice. Now let's talk about that whole 10 minute thing. What can you possibly do in just 10 minutes? Oh my God, you can do so much in 10 minutes. Well, you can watch this video in 10 minutes. I can record this video in 10 minutes. You can carve a stamp. You can write in a journal. You can doodle. You can paint a layer. You can practice drawing. You can gather the supplies for your next project. I actually have several videos here on YouTube where I show you 10 minutes a day over a week, what happens to an art journal spread. And even a painting like this, a huge mural like this on a wall, I did this in small bursts. I believe I might have been pregnant while I did it. And I certainly did a lot of things when my baby was really tiny, where I carved stamps every single day. I just committed to a small commitment, 15 minutes, you know? You'll be shocked by how much you can do. So if you take one thing away from this video, I want you to take away the idea that you should set a timer for 10 minutes every single day and just do something, see what happens. And then take a look back after a week, a month, a year, and you will be amazed at how far you've come. There's nothing like a daily practice. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you'll subscribe to my channel. You can check me out on my blog at ballsredesigns.typepad.com. I do have a podcast called the Adventures in Arting Podcast. And as always, you can find all of my online classes at ballsredesigns.com.